hi and welcome in today's video i will be teaching you the upgraded version of filmmaker app and how to use them properly so if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do that now the first page of the filmmaker app this is how it looks like where you have the saved version of the video you just did and also the project now if you click to the other side you see if your uh, way of paying if you want to pay if you want to become a pro version well you can also do that and now at the other side you'll be seeing the tutorial where they teach you simple effect basic editing and other stuff how to use their app i guess but anyways in this video i will be teaching simple ways and how to use it too because if you click on the tutorial you have to own your data to be able to watch the video and i didn't own my data for this well because i already know how to use them but well, for you you can also do that to learn more well now let's get started i will be clicking on the setting area so you can see different things in a certain area where you want the video to be saving where you want the app to be you can arrange that in your setting area so now we'll click on the new project and this is how the project area looks like this is the editing background where you do all the cutting, the editing, the trimming, the effect, everything you want to do. Now you click to the other side, you click on start, it will bring you to this section where you have the whole video, photo, intro, stock, poster and so on. So you slide through and pick whatever you want to edit on. Now the side where I think they upgraded their version because I already have a tutorial about Filmmaker, you can check that out. But for this particular one where I'm doing it because of the new features I got to see while I upgraded it on my new phone. Yeah. So I have all these new intros I can make use of and also edit to my taste and I can use them for anything. So I will be doing a new intro with this feature so you can watch out for that. Please subscribe to this channel so you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. If you are new here, welcome now this is the previously celebrated uh, activity that just occurred as the halloween and the eid, eid memolu that just went by so you can see they did a customized feature for that you can choose any of that too and for those that love fantastic intro guys you can see you have all the takes all you want in this app you just have to choose the one you like design it to your taste then you're good to go so we have the simple one too where you can also use for your intro i just love recreating i will be recreating different intro for my next video so you can watch out for that too now we have the festive period too and we also have the stock whereby you can use in your video to create beautiful transition and also make your video a little bit film like and it's interesting yeah it's good to use other stuff for your video especially if you're a vlog maker now we have the background you can also pick and we have the green screen free green screen you can also use for your video you can see how cute and beautiful they are you just have to edit it to your taste we have various examples you can make use of and you can edit to your own taste for those that love using the green screen to do different aspect of the videos now you can see the overlay yeah different ways different things you can use now be mindful the other ones that doesn't have pro at the side are the ones you can use why the ones that have pro you have to pay for them before you can use them that's the difference between the pro version and the free version but anyways let's get back to our video so i'll be picking a particular video to edit why to change how to use the other features the upgraded part of other features in the app now this is a video i was trying to tell people that i have two channels and what i intend to use the videos for so i have to unmute the video no i just have to unmute it so I, my voice won't be loud than the video and the video voice or volume won't be louder than mine so guys I will allow the video to play that's how you ought to do you play your video first then you know which area which aspect you have to cut you have to edit you have to touch so you don't just make the editing difficult for yourself you can watch out for my next video on how to 
be prepared or how to train yourself to always upload consistently by making your editing process easier for yourself so you can check that later now we have the train flitter adjust can bonds speed flitter freeze delete volume everything we have it on this app to do the first thing i love to do is to crop I love to crop my video first to preferable size depending on what I'm editing on and in this aspect I'm editing a video of system by nine so I just have to crop it to that side and you can reverse you can see I just finished turning the video all around you can rotate you can also flip sideways anyhow you want to do that you just play around that and use it when necessary in editing your videos so the next thing is to size like size of video like put it in normal size you want as i said earlier after cropping it's also good to put your size in the best size of your video clip like this now is in 4.3 resolution i don't really like this since i'm editing youtube videos so i love to put it at 16 by 9 but it depends on what you want the video to look like right i don't want the empty background to be too obvious so if i use 16 by 9 you can see it will be wide and if i use 4 by 3 it will look close up a little bit so i think i will be going by the 16 by 9 and i'll just be adjusting the other areas like adding some clip filters and other stuff stickers to cover up those empty spaces so that's another way to edit your videos so you just have to get ideas on what you want to do what you intend to do what you want the videos to look like so the next area is the adjust after clicking on the clip you get to see all those features i'm talking about now you can edit Change the brightness, the contrast, saturation, exposure, tint, tint, vein, and high, whatever that word is being called. <laughs> so, guys, you can adjust anything you want, anyhow you want your video to look like. You can see we have more shadow, blur, vibrance, clarity, ambience. In the other format, in the other um, upgraded version of this app, we have all of these, but they are limited. You get to know why I said they are limited if you watch this video to the end. You will be seeing the different v, the different version, the, the upgraded aspect in the new one of this particular one and in that other one. So you can watch the two to compare and tell me in the comment section. Let's get to know. Now I am around the filter area where we have the movie, fibers, everything in that area. So you just have to click on them and choose the parts you want. Cream, summer, and a lot of them. So now let's move to freeze anyway. If you have a particular place you want to freeze and you want the video to skip, then it looks as if you have stopped it. You can click on freeze to do that. Now the speed aspect, if you want your video to be fast, if you want to be slow, depending on what I said earlier, depending on what you are trying to edit on, that is when you can use any of those um, things to adjust your video. For the speed, I love it at 1.0x, I think that's the normal size, so anything beyond that is just oh god look at the volume now it's up to 200 percent before it wasn't up to 200 percent i guess it was 100 percent in my previous video you can check to compare but now they have increased it to 200 percent so my videos no matter how i did or do my recording definitely i can increase the volume from the video then i'm good to go yeah guys i'm surely good to go with this oh god i love this new app i love to edit this with filmmaker it makes my video look as if i am creating a film like it's very very easy and it's also film like it's good for vlogging it's good for any kind of video you want to edit anyway so the next part let me think about the clip where we have the train split called duplicate 
the touch order now i for this area i will be having another video to teach you guys how to use the trim split and cut this area especially for filmmaker it's quite different from other app if you have watched my other videos in my second channel you will be able to know why they are quite different but filmmaker is always is also good because it's put everything in the same area and it made it easier for you to use them and though it's quite different because when you want to trim it's quite different from how you split and how you cut so that's why I said another tutorial for that to explain how best to use them because I've made quite a lot of mistakes using it then I became professional about it so now I can use it the way I like to edit any kind of video i want so i'm a pro in using this app anyway so guys i want you guys to become pro in it and enjoy your editing process so you can post more you can upload more on youtube you know youtube love consistency so that's why i'm sharing these ideas and those beautiful items with you guys so you guys can become more professional and you guys can enjoy the process of always editing yeah editing is fun if you love it just like how i do but if you are cutting you can see you just have to watch the video to the end or to the point where you saw the yellow clip area so you, you know that from that point to the other side that is where the video you can see the red line skipped that is where the video was skipped to. so you have to watch and listen to it to make sure that yes it's at the point you want it to be so you don't just cut the necessary and the good parts out of the video. I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say. So you can shrink it and put it at a point you want it to be like. Anyhow you really want it to be like. This is a full video on its own to teach someone how to use the splits. Cut so I don't have to spend more time in this. Let's move to another area. So now let's add another clip to the already clip we have there so you can join more clips together using the filmmaker app. So if you know you break your video while recording them, you can join them using this app. You can see it's a very friendly app for content creators. You can add as many clips you want, but I just will be picking up one just to teach and continue the video tutorial so now it will always move to the back of the video and push the other one to the front depending on where this yellow line been note this yellow line thing you're editing wherever it is whatever effect you do that's exactly where that thing will be joining in or will be put coming in into like this video i just picked came to the front as you can see so now i will still be cropping choosing the size which is 16 by 9 so it can rhyme with the previous one you get what i'm saying so guys make sure you are editing properly now you can see that it's already at a size it came with but i don't really want the size because i want it to be equal with the other size so i just have to adjust move and find the best fit i think is okay for it then I'll be pressing the max sign. Enter you click on that max sign, it shows that your edits or stuff is already accepted. It's now changed to the version or to the area you want it to be like to what you exactly want it to be like. Let me put it that way. So I've already reduced the volume of this video too, so it won't be louder than my voice. But if you want to watch this particular video, the aftermath of this video, you can check the link in the description box. Then you are good to go. So now I am at the area where you can add transition, animation, things, different aspects to this edit when you are editing your video. Now we have the graphics where you can add color and maybe, I don't know, maybe if you want to block something, then you want the graphics to come in. So you can just use color to cover that particular area, increase the volume of your pencil. You can erase it so you can see the cleaner sign beside it. So you can now write something beside it, like maybe a text or maybe an information you want people to see. Then 
you can add animation opacity color i just love white so that's why i'm using <laughs> white to color and adjust the area and this is just a sketch like a rough editing stuff just to teach you guys things you can do so i will be redoing i'll uh, re-editing this particular video and make it in the right way i want it to look like so you can check that in the description box to watch it now you can see what i'm talking about that you can bring it up and down using the transition effect of this particular area so the upgraded version of filmica is quite nice i love the way the improve more yeah they've improved more so now let's move to another area where we can add sticker flicker and the music and record which is at this other side yeah now you can customize the watermark for yourself god filmica is so good like i just love this new upgraded version but the only thing is that you have to pay before you can use it like you just have to pay yeah you have to pay so now this video is for kayaking moment my other channel is cultural before thai so i will be editing to my taste like customizing the watermark in the way i want it but guys i just uh, let me just say i'm using this as an example because you know you have to pay and i didn't pay for this app like i'm using the free version to edit my videos and if you check out my channel you'll see all my videos are quite good and quite okay yeah very very okay so you can check them out now i can pick color i can pick a layout of how i want my watermark to look like god they made it look professional like yeah if you really need a watermark you can do it yourself yeah but you just have to pay to be able to click on that mark sign because it won't move out of that <laughs> anyways let's move to the next one now you can add your voice over to your videos as you can see the voice over is quite okay too so you just have to trim it you can put it in the particular area you want you can make it fade in then you can make it fade out there are different things you can use for your voice over you can also copy twice add speed volume as you can see our volume is now up to 200 so anyways anyhow any way or manner you really wish to edit a video you'll be seeing it out in this aspect as you can see now this is the sign it will be like to tell you that yes you just recorded a video or you just record a voiceover in the app so it's quite easy and understandable i love the hub now you can choose a ratio of format you really want to edit your video into that's the proper way to do it if you know you want to edit your clip like the whole video itself choosing a particular size to eat so that's how you're gonna be doing it and now we are at the sticker area you can see it has lots of sticker that you can use god i just love filmmaker like uh -uh, they include different areas different things so all i just have to do is to click on download to download the free version the free ones i am able to use and for the professional i know i have to pay so even the free ones are okay to use god god bless filmmaker for doing this now we have a download you can pick or bring in your logo if you have any one you can see now and it also have a way of helping you erase there like you can edit the the picture the sticker anything you want to use, you can edit them god i've overdo it <laughs> you can see i've cleaned some certain area but you know i said this video is just a tutorial telling you guys of the updated version or let me just say it's a uh, plain lesson tutorial for you guys <laughs> So now let's move to the next one. We have the blending, they have the flitter adjust and the outline shadow. Anyhow, you want to edit the clip you just brought in. That is the sticker you just brought in. You can edit it to your taste and also enjoy the process. Now you can also add text and you can design the text. You can have the normal animated variety design cinematic. 
yeah just do it the way you want it to look like depending on what you are editing on so take your time to enjoy this app take your time to use it properly take your time to love what you do and edit well with this app i hope you're enjoying using it as much as i'm enjoying filming and teaching you guys how to make use of it sharing my secret and everything with you guys now i am at the music section the sound effects and my music instead of downloading your sound effects filmmaker already have some basic sound effects you can easily use for your video all you just have to do is download and by clicking on the download that is the plus sign at the other side so the ones that doesn't have the plus sign or that has a plus sign but as a pro beside it you should know you can use that to your pay for it but still not you can use every other features you have within to recreate or do something beautiful in your video now i picked a flitter a sticker from the app and that's the subscribe button that's majorly what i just love to use in the in the sticker area yeah i love all the subscribe the logos and everything i just love using them now you can also add featured that says like transition you can put some in your favorite it will be there and they are the free and also the pro version in using this app too can you see god that looked like as if i'm creating a movie wow black and white gosh oh no i just love this new upgraded version of filmmaker yeah i love it so much guys i just love it now i can add them in my favorites if i want to but I'll be doing that next time. I will be doing that by myself. But for the sake of this video, let's dive into other things, other features, other things filmmaker has for us. Like, you just have to choose from any of this effect. Then you are good to go, guys. You are absolutely good to go. Now we have the film glitch rhyme psychoped at vintage. I don't really need this side. Chidelic. Yeah, you have different ways to just edit your clip using any of those um, formats. Yeah. So, guys, I hope you enjoy using this app. I love using this app. So, you can take your time and also enjoy using this app. It's absolutely good for anything you really want to use it for. It helps you more like i mean, you know creating a professional video yeah like it makes a video work just so beautiful and well like a professional yeah and they call it filmmaker maybe that's why well it's really like a film so now i am at the next phase playing every editing i just done how i have done so far and you can see they are all well arrange now i really need to screenshot some areas i can use the picture for my thumbnail but this isn't advisable anyone listening to this you shouldn't be doing this instead you should snap or shoot yourself off recording and snap an intended video like yes intended video not a video you just created or not a picture you just create you screenshot from your video they aren't looking professional and if you want to increase your click rate of your video of your page on youtube after being consistent make sure you're working on your thumbnail i have videos about how to use a thumbnail so you can check that out so i will be adding some text to this like since i am teaching you guys on the advanced an updated version of filmmaker tutorial so i think i should be using that to advertise and tell people <laughs> so you just have to use that word anyways i use the word just because i want to test the text area like every features we have in a text area every new things we have in the text area so that's why i wrote that statement you know i said this today is just me explaining and teaching you guys things but it's not really like i'm editing a particular clip for that you can check out for my next video on how i use it to edit i will be sharing everything in detail so you can check them out so guys endeavor to subscribe to my channel to be able to use 
any of those things i uploaded fastly so let's move on to the part after editing you can also choose different ways or how you want your text to look like by adding color background blending outline shadow space opacity and lots more yeah in choosing a background color for your test you can also use the preset or the gradient or the texture depending on how you really want the video to look like you can make use of any of this guys i hope you are enjoying this video please give me a thumbs up and tell me in the comment section your thoughts about it and how you also love using it or what app you love to use i would love to hear from you guys so we can learn from one another so you just have to adjust the text in the preferred side the preferred way and preferred manner you want it to come out like because after saving every changes you have done so far is what you'll be saying why the video is playing so you can take your time to edit and enjoy the process to so editing is an ad it's just when you didn't plan so watch out for my video to know more about how to edit easily and faster so you can be consistent on youtube now you can also click on the text you've done so far and correct any error that you've done and one thing about filmmaker is that it keeps the safe file of your video in its own area like i told you earlier where i have the new project and you have the other stuff you can see it down there too so guys enjoy the process of editing after saying that enjoy the process of editing editing is quite interesting if it's something you love doing find passion and doing it anyway as a youtuber you really know how to you really must know how to edit yeah very very sure you really must know how to edit now you can go back to check out the previous editing you've done so far and also screenshot whatever you want to screenshot but i told you earlier it's good to create an intended photo for your thumbnail not the one you cut out of your videos anyway so i think i am good to go i think i have done and touch all the areas of this app teaching you guys what the new upgraded version has installed for us so if you haven't updated your app i guess you should so you won't be missing out on all this new effects some stickers and music transitions everything everything it has and stuff for so with this being said, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I am Kausara and Kiaki, but I'm popularly known as Kiaki. Just a nickname. And I also enjoyed being called that. Anyways, see you guys in my next video. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe to my channel. In this channel, I create videos to help people and to also share my moments with people so if you know you are interested in watching any of these you can subscribe to this channel so you can learn and be a part of this family and i love to create hijab videos too as a muslima anyways not that saying that doesn't mean if you are a christian i don't love you i also have christian friends <laughs> But guys, that's it, that's it, that's it. I will be seeing you guys in my next video. Till then, peace out. Stay safe, stay blessed. And I'll be seeing you in my next video. Till then, bye and stay safe.